The Rockford Raptors Soccer Club is gearing up to go to Nationals for the first time since the club was created in 1996. 23 News reporter Queenie Ama talks to the team about their journey. So specifically, the U16 team was created eight years ago and has had much of the same 17 girls on the team. Now, over the years, the girls have created more than a friendship, and they say that's what has led them into the Nationals. Raptors out! Mike Rizzo took over the Rockford Raptors all-girls soccer team three years ago with the goal of getting the group to nationals. Um, it's like crazy, like none of us expected this and it's what we've been working for. Um, I think it's like a very big opportunity for us, especially for our future plans for soccer and I think it's crazy to be the first girls team to do it and it just feels like a huge accomplishment and I'm very proud of like all of us. While Rizzo's dream came true this year, he says all the credit belongs to the girls. That the girls have uh, put in so much work um, and the parents uh, that, you know, we're really excited to be a part of this. The Raptors earned a berth at Nationals and will travel to the tournament in July at the ESPN Zone in Orlando, Florida. The girls say this experience makes their bond even stronger. We've all gotten more close as teammates and as friends, and it just helps us on the field to know that we're all so close and get along so well. Um, it was really exciting. Like, once the ref blew the whistle, like, we all came together because we knew, like, we'd worked hard to get here and to win that game. Coach Rizzo says regardless of the tournament's outcome, he is extremely proud of the girls. They continue to improve each and every year. This year, they kind of hit their stride, and it's been really, really exciting to watch. The tournament in Orlando runs from July 19th to the 24th. So only 16 girls' soccer teams qualify for nationals. Quite an impressive feat. Mm -hmm, definitely, Five definitely. feet. Yeah. That's an impressive feat. <laughs> yes. All right. Well, about a million Fitbit.